Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's video. Today we've got the next installment of the YouTubers Pass Around, so stick around and see what we got today. Shazam! Welcome back ladies and gentlemen. Matt Weaver, your friendly neighborhood appliance repair man, coming to you live and in Technicolor from my shave den. Um, today's shave of the day for January 24th, 2015. As mentioned previously, as part of the YouTubers Pass Around, um, and the implements of destruction are, once again, my vintage Solingen straight razor. I call a double duck, because there's two little duckies there. Um, the soap today is this guy right here, Douglas Cutlery Private Reserve Shave Soap. And it is a hard soap. Uh, I've had it soaking here. I've had it blooming. And I get kind of a sort of a classic cologne scent. A little citrusy. I'm not really good at picking out particular aromas or scents. But it just kind of smells like a classic cologne. And I'm going to be pairing that. I'm going to do a little post-shave sensitive balm from Nivea there. And uh, I think this pairs really well with this Douglas Cutlery, the uh, Gillette series Cool Wave Aftershave. Uh, the brush I'm going to be using is uh, the Smoke 1305. <clears throat> uh, because this is a hard puck, I think the bore will do better with this. So, let's see how it goes. Well, before I start... I always forget this part. I don't know why it's the most important part of the shave. <laughs> the shave ridge. And I am double fisting it today. Got some hot Earl Grey tea. Always with a little bit of honey in there. And what's in my Glen Cairn? Good old Jim Beam White Label. Pretty good for a fifteen bottle, fifteen dollar bottle of booze. All right, we'll load this quite heavily here. You know, in appearance, this kind of reminds me of the soap does anyway of uh, the Synergy. I don't know if it's the two point oh. Uh, but it's a, it looks like inconsistency anyway, uh, that soap, uh, the chocolate bourbon in particular. Seems to be lathering up real nicely here. Now, I will say this, I haven't watched any of the other reviews on this soap that were done by my fellow YouTube YouTubers, so I'm going in this with a completely open mind. So I'll just wet my face a little. I have to say my clean shaven face here was not received real well by my better half. Much like Susie, Anthony, my girl likes the goatee, so I'm going to grow it back. So I'm just taking the proto lather there and I'm going to work that into my face. Use it as a bit of a pre. Granted, 
I loaded the hell out of this thing. But still. I gotta tell you, in having lathered that chocolate bourbon, that Synergy chocolate bourbon, so many, 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 many times, the lather's acting the same too. Almost has a chunky quality to it. See, I'm going to grab my Allen block here. All right, let's get right to it. First, though, here's to you, folks. We'll nip off the shave ridge. <clears throat> Earlier I had the chance to watch the video that Joey from Queens uh, did of the New York meetup. And I have to say that looks just like a fantastic time. Looks like you, all of my brothers that were able to attend had a blast. And I hope to be able to join you folks someday uh, to meet all the great guys. Uh, funds don't allow it right now. <laughs>
Very nice. Very nice indeed. Tiniest little nick over here somewhere, which has already disappeared. Nope, there it is. Seems to be a trouble spot for me. Look at all that lather. scent on this reminds me of something but it's one of those things where I can't put my finger on it exactly a little touch of water here All right, second pass. Like a lot of guys, I get myself when I first touch the blade to my neck.
squeaky clean. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> squeeze the last bit of lather out of the brush and do some light touch-ups. Look at that lather. Nice stiff peaks. Feels pretty slick in, in my hands. Not as slick as some I felt, but. Still pretty slick, all in all. Really nice cushion. I'm just going to rinse off and then we'll talk a little bit more about this soap. major but all in all really really nice shave about as close to a BBS as I'm gonna get uh, just gonna run the Allen block over my neck here Try to close up those tiny little nicks.
Mm. Lovely. Time for some Nivea balm. Dog, dog's in there freaking out, acting like a tard. Just dropping this to dry it out, dry out the edge. Something I've seen several hone meisters recommend. <clears throat> All right, thoughts on the soap? Um, I was really, really impressed with the performance on it. Uh, it lathers a lot like the Synergy soap. And if anybody has the how, how to grow mustache chocolate bourbon, now granted, I've got some proto lather in there, but it's a hard soap, very similar consistency to this stuff. Oh, makes me want to get a chocolate sundae and throw a shot of bourbon on top of it. <laughs> um, but we're not talking about this one. We're talking about Douglas Cutlery Private Reserve Shaving Soap. <clears throat> the scent, pretty good, not fantastic, uh, but something I certainly would use again. Um, the performance was really good, not as slick as some soaps that I've uh, seen out there, but really good cushion uh, once you give it enough water. Um, all in all, uh, pretty darn good soap. So, uh, you know, if you can pick up a puck, go grab some. I think you'll be impressed. Uh, I'd give it an A-. minus. If we're going to give it a grade, you know, maybe a 4 out of 5 stars. Uh, could be slicker. Uh, the scent could be more robust or different scents. I don't know. I really know nothing about the company. Um, so they may have other scents, but uh, I like this one. But there's better scents out there. Uh, so four out of five stars, uh, you know, A minus, I would say. Um, was impressed with the soap. Pleasantly surprised. Going to finish it up with this Gillette Cool Wave aftershave. They got similar scents, uh, the soap and the aftershave too. So there we have it, folks. Douglas Cutlery Shaving Soap gets a big thumbs up. So I've already rambled on for 25 minutes here, so we'll cut this off right here. So until next time, America, friendly neighborhood appliance repairman saying happy shaving.